about our soldiers. Who's this? Captain Bailey, and what's his wife's name? Amin. Amin. Okay. We were talking about them last week as our adopted soldiers, and one of the things that this lesson reminds us of is that our soldiers sacrifice every single day of their lives for us and for other people. And as Mother uh, Beth is pointing out, this is an example of God's work in our world. Every soldier on duty in every place on our planet is representing God's work out among us. And that sacrifice, it's a hard life for them. They face danger. They face isolation from their families, being away from their friends, missing things that are really important in their lives. But their mission to them is greater than that. Their mission is to serve their country, and it's also a way that they serve their God. You, we, upper elementary students, are also examples of serving God in the same way when we do things for our soldiers, when we pray for them, when we send them cards and letters, when we let them know that their sacrifice is not going unnoticed. That's something that we, that's our gift and our way of being God out in our world today, supporting our soldiers in that way. We see the love of God through the sacrifice of our soldiers. We see the love of God through the work that you do for our soldiers. And there's a payback for that. Sometimes you get to know what that means. And so, we have a surprise for you today. when you're out on patrol, you know, uh, serving and fighting out there to come back and have some, uh, some letters waiting, especially Valentine's Day when uh, in February, you know, it was raining about every day out there. And you wouldn't think in Afghanistan it rains a whole lot, but in, in February it rained just about every day. So coming back and I got your, uh, your cards and whatnot, it really brightened my day. And it brightened uh, a bunch of my Marine days that uh, got to look at the cards as well. So thank you very much for that. Um, like uh, my wife talked about, you know, she's from Dallas. I'm from Baltimore, Maryland. Originally, I went to the Naval Academy, and that's where I met uh, me, um, which was uh, pretty awesome. And uh, then I graduated, went into the Marine Corps. Uh, I'm an infantry officer. My wife's a supply officer. And uh, after all my training, I was assigned to 1st Battalion, 8th Marines, which is stationed down in Camp Lejeune, North Carolina. So uh, once I got down there, I deployed once to Iraq, 
uh, western Iraq, just to the west of Baghdad, if you've studied uh, some geography and whatnot. Uh, and then came back in uh, September 2009 from Iraq. And then uh, she deployed in January 2010, came back August 2010, and I turned around and left in September 2010. Uh, so I was deployed from September all the way to uh, this past month of March um, of this year. So just what you guys have done uh, and, you know, with your class, your teachers and whatnot, supporting those that are in the military and what, it means a whole lot. So getting your cards, very important. So just listen to your, uh, listen to your teachers. They know, uh, they know a great deal about life and about the military and serving. And I know each and every one of you will grow up, make your parents and your teachers all proud. So thank you once again. Okay, Captain and Lieutenant Bailey, we have a souvenir for you to take back with you. Uh, this is a gift from the children. And we hope that you will Fill it up with pictures of all of your many experiences in any place that you go. Hopefully not in another battle zone, but if it is, here's a place to capture your memories. <laughs> 